on this episode, we go from this to this. What's up guys, welcome back. As you saw in the last video, managed to kill the motor on this. Turns out I also killed the um, electronics on it as well. So this time, rather than fiddling about trying to get it back to how it was, I've gone all in, as well as getting a new motor in there. So I fit a new motor in there, um, as you can see. Bought that off eBay for just under six pounds, so about eight dollars for a new motor. Everything else I managed to get out of my spares bin. Had an old Ripmax 116th um, truck. I've taken the combined electronics out of there. So we've got a receiver and electronic speed controller in there. And I've also got the micro servo out there. I've just stuck the micro servo on with a little bit of hot glue and just cut out a little hole in there for it. It's not the best job, but it works. Steering's still not the best, but it's much better than it was before. Also got a little um, 2S LiPo run in there just to power the whole thing up. As you saw at the start of this video, definitely performs a little bit better. So let's see if we can get over them rocks, see how we get on with a tug of war with the WL toys, and also we'll see what difference it has made to the speed of this thing. So anyway, let's have a look. Three, two, one, go. Ooh. Three, two, one, go. That's a tie. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, go. So there we go, don't really need to say much about it. As you can see by the video, massive improvement with the um, upgraded electronics in there from a hobby grade. That new motor, definitely much more powerful. It's surprising thing is the, the LiPo in there, it's only 7.4 volts, that 2S LiPo, whereas the stock battery um, is 9.6. So even with less voltage there, uh, because we've got that better motor, better electronics, um, and the, because the LiPo's power delivery yeah, is better, makes a massive improvement. Speed run, uh, stock out of the box, we've got nine kilometers an hour. This time we've got 25. Uh, that speed run was done at the end of the, uh, I'd done all the other stuff first, so the battery wasn't fully charged. I did off camera, I did charge the battery again um, and done the speed run straight away and actually got 28 kilometers an hour. So more than three times uh, the stock speed with um, that new setup in there. Off-road, massive difference. Obviously, no suspension, so it's still, still not really. It doesn't really perform all that well off-road, but as you can see, um, it pulls on that grass much easier. I couldn't even reverse with it out of the box, and now pulls much better. Um, uh, just doesn't steer very well. Even when now I've got proportional steering, um, it still it just doesn't steer very well. Um, I think you could probably modify it a bit more and get it better, but you know, by the time you start spending all this money on it, you might as well buy something um, an actual hobby grade. Um, truck and on the rocks easy straight over them um, didn't have any problems at all obviously again no suspension so it was bouncing about but it pulled over them rocks straight away as for the tug of war um, I think the WL Toys is probably the stronger one it was just a bit slippery so it's just spinning the wheels I think if I'd done it on grass or on carpet the WL Toys probably would have just about won it but compared to last time it's, it's a bit slippery last time but it just dragged it along, um, didn't have any problems dragging it along last time, whereas uh, this time it just stood there and stood its ground, didn't move at all. So yeah, massive improvement. Not going to do much more of it, 
I'm going to use that body though. Um, go to waste if I got rid of that body. Uh, I don't know what I do with the rest. I'll probably just probably end up in the bin. I'll take the motor out, and the electronics out, and the rest will probably just go. Um, but that body's too good to uh, to throw away. So get the stickers off. Probably repaint it. Um, touch it up. Make it look a little bit more uh, realistic. Um, and yeah, put it on uh, put it on one of my scale trucks. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Uh, coming up, uh, we've got the WL Toys will have a brushes upgrade coming soon. I've already put, it's already got the metal diffs in it, so the metal gears in it. I just need to um, get the motor and ESC fitted. Probably going to need a better battery though. The stock battery is probably not up to it. So I'm going to get a decent battery, get that brushes in there, and then that'll be coming up soon. And then I've got a couple of just, just a few bashing videos coming up as well. Anyway, cheers for the support. If you're not a subscriber, click that subscribe, support the channel. Uh, and if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. See you next time. Cheers.